Brian and Emma, you two entitled Karen and Kevin idiots are in big ass trouble. I cannot believe that you have shoved Caillou into his locker and I had to call the ambulance. But Miss Kumi, it wasn't us who did it. Yeah Miss Kumi, we're being honest to God. Hey Galu, want to hear a joke? Duh, what's the joke guys? What do you call when two crazy dinosaurs eating chicken fingers from Chicken Express? Duh, I'm not sure, but what is it? It's, it's called, called Get, get in, in the Locker, locker bitch. bitch. Hey, what are you? Hey, get the hell off of me you crazy delusional Karen and Kevin Scatterbrains. Ouch. How fucking dare you push me into my locker? You two are in big ass trouble when someone finds out about what you've done. Shit. But Miss Kumi, Haruhi Suzumaya must be the one who set us up. No. Don't you fucking dare pin this shit on Haruhi because she had nothing to do with it. Now Kevin and Karen, get your sorry asses to detention right now. This is so not fair. Life ain't fair you little twerps. Deal with it. Welcome to detention. There will be no talking, no phones, no games, no music, and especially no goofing off. So you two will have to spend the rest of the day to think about what you have done to Caillou Anderson so don't think about anything else. Fuck, Fuck you, you, you freaky, freaky ass, ass bitch. bitch. Let, Let us, us go, go now, now bitch. bitch. Brian and Emma, how fucking dare you two call me a freaky ass bitch while dancing like jackasses. Go to the principal's office now. Fine, Fine. Bitch. bitch. I heard that Kevin and Karen. So Brian and Emma, why are you two in my office? We pushed Galu into his locker and got in detention. And we called Damien Galifsky a freaky ass bitch. Brian and Emma, how fucking dare you shove Galu, I mean Caillou, into his locker rounding up in detention and call Damien Galski a freaky ass bitch. That's so fucking big ass it. You two are suspended until the end of March. You two go home now. <laughs> Oh my fucking god, Brian and Emma, you two entitled Karen and Kevin little towards. I'm so fucking mad at what you two did. We can't believe that you two pushed Caillou into his locker, end up in detention and called Damien Galifsky a freaky ass bitch. During your suspension from school, you two are grounded and so that means no Easter candy or presents no fucking shit for either of you. This is personal karma for everything bad you two do to me. You two are just like your ugly mother. Go to your rooms now. <laughs> Yay, it's finally Easter, doesn't that kick ass Emma? Yes Brian, let's go find and get some Easter candy and other goodies. What? Nothing's in the garage? What? Nothing in the dining room? Empty handed? Empty handed wa a a a a a a that's right you entitled Karen and Kevin, no Easter for you this year. Matter of fact, you two ain't getting absolutely nothing for Easter this year or any other year. Ever again. Well, in order to make up the damages that you two and your mother caused, especially when she spoils you two rotten, we got something for you. You two better get to it before your dad is gonna reconsider. Oh, oh yes, yes, there, there is, is an Easter, Easter miracle, miracle after, after, all. after all. What the hell kind of Easter presents are these? This is not what we had in mind. Too fucking bad for both of you. These are the lumps of coal that you two and your mother gave me last Christmas. We wanted Easter candy. 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 Right. You two and your mother called me a big baby and said I'm acting childish. Well, who's being big babies and acting childish now? Go cry in your rooms and take those lumps of coal with you. Yeah. We're just going to have a better Easter time without you two. Now go. <laughs> Worst, Worst Easter, Easter ever. ever. God. I fucking hate my kids and my ex-wife so goddamn much. Calm down, Dave. At least they're out of our heads. Let's go to the arcade and forget about all that. 